throwing up by your boy Joe fame coming at you. I just want to talk about something really quick. Are you thinking about getting into music in general? Is it a good time to start learning music, either if you want to be a DJ or a music producer? Is it the right time? Well, it is because there's so much happening when it comes to technology and the way it's growing. DJ started out with building units that are standalone units where you don't even need a computer anymore. You can now DJ freely without a computer. Music production is now going in the same route. So between the MPC that has a standalone, the new machine that's coming out is also standalone. There's going to be so much new technology that's going to come out that everything's going to be Ripley standalone soon who knows what the future holds i guarantee you there's going to be more ram and more storage built into these units where you won't even need a computer at all and that's the way i think it's going to go where you can basically just make music all the time without relying on a pc which i think would be amazing if this happens you know five to ten years from now where you can put 30 party plugins onto your standalone unit to produce music once that happens, that's going to be a game changer and the world's going to change. But right now, it is that because you got all the tools right at you, right at your fingertips. Like, you have no idea how easy it is to make music nowadays. You got so many tools from music theory tools, different plugins to give you different sounds, easy ways to make your own sounds. The way that music was back in the day, playing instruments was an ideal. It it really still is. Like if you could play an instrument, you're already ahead of the game. But for people that don't know how to play an instrument but they still want to make music, you still can because sounds are getting more realistic, samples are getting more better and better. I go through samples every day. Sometimes you find not so great ones, but then you can find some really good ones. And just by just tweaking it your own and some effects and some different EQs, layering different sounds, you're making your own sound right from there. So it's not as hard as it used to be, let's say maybe 15, 20 years ago, where people had to learn the MPC, which was like really expensive and only industry people had that. Or if you had FL Studios that had like those really robotic sounds that just sounded really plain awful before they changed their whole platform now it's like amazing doll too so if you use fl studios go ahead but it's time it's time <laughs> if you ever think about being a dj if you were think about getting into music production or anything music related at all do it now because there's so much tools at your fingertips that you have no idea like now the cd j3000 is coming out for new pioneer dj controller so if you're a dj and you want to know the flagship controller and you want to be able to reach that milestone you can start on the smaller stuff which basically once you learn that you can use that on a bigger high-end stuff you don't need all the flashy gear anymore you can still do the same thing that big time djs and big time producers are using for half the cost like you like really just literally have a door system Get your plugins and use a keyboard and mouse and you can make beats right off that you don't need anything fancy you can get a cheap controller do that simple not fancy it works great i'm just making this quick video i know i haven't done it in a while because i'm working on my ep i'm really hard at work on my ep and i'm trying to find talent to actually <laughs> lay it over but right now the beats i'm making are coming out really good so i'm working on this ep to try to get that going so that's why I haven't done a video in a little bit. I'm gonna do a lot more videos because there's so much stuff coming out between a new CDJ 3000 just got announced, the new machine standalone that just got announced. It's just so much technology is coming out. So do yourself a favor, stop thinking and start doing. Even if you start on the cheapest way possible, do it. If you wanna get into music production and you really don't know, get MPC beats, get yourself a free door and jump right in simple ways you can make beats afraid it's just a good way to start going if you want to start djing you can you can still learn get yourself virtual dj if you have to or go out and buy yourself a really cheap dj controller and learn off that nothing can really stop you i know money can be tough there's websites that offer payment plans even on cheap options so even if you want to get like a cheap 200 dollars controller you still can make payment plans on them through certain sites so you can do it, you know, it's, there's ways, there's not really a tough obstacle that you really got to face, you can, you can do it, this is your time to do it, so if you think about doing it, do it, this is just a really short video, just trying to hope and motivate you, if you want to get into music, or you want to get into DJing, and you're just not too sure, if you want to get into anything, even entertainment related, should I still pick up an instrument, should I still learn how to sing, yes, because the tools are there, you want to learn how to sing, I just found like amazing tools, for you to learn how to sing right now i'm not gonna do it because i don't like singing but 
there's even tools to make you sound better for singing. Yeah, pick up a bass, pick up a guitar, pick up drums. Because once you learn that, if you can learn an instrument, you can learn any software really easy. If you don't know how to play an instrument or you don't want the hassle of trying to learn an instrument, no problem. Buy yourself a cheap MIDI controller or not even. Get yourself a free DAW and get at it with a keyboard and mouse. Start making music. Nothing's holding you back. Like today's industry is crazy. There's so much technology coming out. 2020 has shown so much improvement when it comes to the next generation of things to come. I think this is like the step itself, everything from cameras to video games. 2020 has been stepping up with the technology and where we're gonna end up in the further years. I still think in the next five to maybe 10 years, we are gonna see standalone units that are standalone. That will probably have enough RAM and probably have enough storage to run third party plugins or third party other essentials to get your unit working properly without needing a PC. I definitely see that coming. It's definitely gonna come. PCs are gonna be obsolete. Your laptop, you really only need that to really check your email, search the web, <laughs> and that's really it. But when it comes to creative points, everything's gonna be standalone. Uh, who knows, they may even make a standalone camera where you can edit inside your camera, just like how you do on the phone. It, it's endless possibilities are there. So technology is growing, so jump on it now. Today is the time to jump on it now with so much tools from YouTube to different books to anything you see, just join a Facebook group. You just join a Facebook group alone, you're gonna learn so much. Uh, so do that, get on it, get motivated. Definitely start making music, be creative. We're gonna continue to create music and entertainment in general. So whatever your entertainment is, jump on it. There's so much tools out there, no matter what you wanna do in life, do it because you can always learn. There's so many tools by just Google, YouTube, you can learn your talent, learn your hobby, and grow with it. So I'm just doing this to let you guys know, don't quit, don't give up. I've been having those little moments here and there. That's why I haven't also never done a video. I'm like, I really don't know what I want to put out, but I want to be motivational. And I want to let you guys know that we are in this together. We are fighting through it and we're going to take our hobby and we're going to stick with it. And we don't want to give up so easily. Don't give up on your dreams. Don't give up on your hopes. Don't even give up on your hobbies because that's what keeps you you. That's what makes you unique. That keeps you motivated. That keeps you happy. And something you can rely back on too when things get tough. So stay with it. And I hope to see you guys in the next one. I don't know what I'm going to have up next, but we'll see. Uh, I'm probably going to maybe do some NPC tutorials since I'm learning more and more about it. So let's see it so make sure you like comment and subscribe let me know what you want to buy next what unit are you excited for you are you excited for the new cdj 3000 are you excited for the M machine standalone are you still mpc user and you want to get into the mpc world or if you're just a simple musician trying to do other ways let me know down in the comments because i definitely want to hear what everybody's going through and uh, how you're being creative all right i'll see you guys later peace